But there's been times in Dow's history where it's been viewed very negatively by the public. Uh, I'm talking about producing products that were used in Vietnam, uh, dioxin in the Titabawasi River, uh, millions of dollars in EPA fines. How do you reconcile that past as you move into the future? Well, I think in, with any company and with any industry, as you move through time, things are, you find out things about different products or different chemistries that are used. And we've seen it in a lot of industries over time. And I think that Dow stepped up to address many of those concerns and, and tried to do it in a way that was positive and constructive. Um, you know, I can't speak to the fines at the time and what that situation was, but I think if you look at how we addressed the situation, we tried to be constructive, tried to work with the government, tried to work with the community to work through those. And out of every one of those incidents, we learned something and we build that into how we move forward and do things in a better way. And so I think if you look at the last uh, 30 years of progress that we've made here, things have been a lot different for Dow. And I think we're on a much more positive foot going forward. And we wanna try to sustain that. It doesn't mean that something might not happen in the future that turns out to be negative, but we're gonna do our best to try to avoid that.